you know where you are? This is Nollywood Pictures TV. What is the matter with you, Kodele? Do you want to get the beating of your life? Beat me! Just because I told you to put it in. What nonsense truth have you told us, Okodele? Okodele, you are insulting us. And we want you... No! I want you to leave this compound now! Oh. This same compound, we are young men of our land, work as laborers, roasting meat for a fellow young man like us from another town. Ah, uh, I look at the three of you and I wonder, does this mean that our Osili is inferior to his? Hey, 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 Okudele, your provocation is getting too much. Leave this place now before we descend on you. Oh, descend on me? Okay, no problem. People do not have become a successful hunter in our own land, killing our own animals and the young men who we need for him. For me? Can't say that, bro. Uh. I may lose it one day. With this useless idiot that will never mind his business. Obukwe, I listen to him carefully. I think he has a point. There is something Chiku Dinibo is doing right that we are doing wrong. We need to ask ourselves, what is it? I'm <laughs> Why have you refused to teach any young man of Osili your hunting skills? What are you saying? I am the one they call Okudi. I was trained never to look at faces. There is something you know about this forest that we the young men don't. And that is why each day you gun down our animals. Teach us that we may grow together. Teach us. Would it be that the youths of this land are thinking the same exact thing? But I'm not hiding anything from them. I believe I'm just favored by the gods. I greet you. The most handsome man in the city. The only man that came all the way from Urunebo and outdid the men of Osele in their own land. Chai, I greet you. How are you? <laughs> oh, fine. <laughs> Seeing you know should make any maiden happy. <laughs> You flatter me. No, not at all. I speak only for the truth. Every maiden in this community longs for the day you, Chukudimibo, will speak sweetly to her. Or even call her young girl. <laughs> Very well, ladies. Carry on. Go. <laughs> ah, Ukuroma. Ukurutupuruma. With a lot of money too. What else should a medal ask for? Mm. Ah! Um. 
totally forgot that you are here with me. Look okay. at him. Is he not handsome? Oh. What was that rubbish for? What rubbish? Zara, Zara, get away from me now. Don't let us get you offended. I'm just buying this meat because you know I need meat. This is just bone. Okay, you may come in now, in now, in now. Give me my money. Give up, you think it's easy? Enter that bush and go and kill your own animal. I'm not the only one who is in the mud. Yeah? You are poor, 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 poor. Give up, poor, poor. Give up, poor, poor. What do you think? This is your sister. Odukwe, about what you said earlier, eh? I don't blame you, because I've known that you are destined to be useless. <laughs> hey, my Duka and your useless mouth. What's the truth? How can you call a man, a full-grown man, useless? Hey, hello, man. Hey, Odukwe, if I were you, eh, I will deal with him. Seriously? I'm not going to go to the house. I'm not going to go to the house. Why would I waste my energy on someone that has no control over his mouth? Tell me. What are you saying? Of the truth. If not that the God sent you to our land from his own land. A great hunter. And he employed the whole world. Useless. <laughs> I bless the gods for saving us from salvation through the hands of a young man from Urunebo. But really, you would have been chasing cricket about. No more requested for this. Prepare them for him before sunset. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> What is your problem? You don't eat him. He is too good in the world. Not there for everybody that. Stop being always like this. Please, I am so surprised that you know the meaning of that word always. Like. You said I'm supposed to be the one angry here. Why were you acting back as if I was a nobody? And you think I will stand? What should you be like that? Mm -hmm. I am mm -hmm. such a child. Go up. What is wrong with you? I hear the voices from the backyard. Go to ask her. She always loses her senses whenever she comes across to put me. I'm just tired of your child. It's a lot to put in again. What is wrong with you? Why kill yourselves over a man that has no time for you? No, Gucci. That is not even the issue. Zarabia is simply jealous because she knows that you could mobilize me more. Oh, really? Sorry. Who is jealous? Me. Sorry. I will always remind both of you that Chukudinibo will never settle for a lady who fights over him or flaunts herself cheaply at him. Keep wasting your time and energies. Meanwhile, when you do fight, meet me. I don't know why you are boiling. <laughs> Something <sweet>. is. <laughs> if not that, her father was the person that handed her over to me to marry. Five years ago, to have sent her back in Spain. Why? What did she do? I asked my wife to shut up. Hey, but uh, I don't share my brother. That is not enough reason for you to consider sending your wife back in. What other reasons? There is always a way to follow women. I'm not going to you work as you know. Now you go. Don't tell me the meat is ready already. 
Chukudu Lubo never fails. <laughs> you can say that again. Because these my customers here, they are already demanding for the meat. <laughs> This is the time I usually like. I'm using UK, UK. Please. Take this meat and go and prepare it. As you can see, these my customers here are already demanding for the meat. Okay. Take me easy, boss. Please, uh, tell uh, Chuku to the boy that you will hear from me first thing tomorrow morning. He asks that I collect balance. I just gave you a message, didn't I? Oh, okay. Hey, Lucia, if I may ask you, what exactly did your wife say that you asked her to shut up? They are stupid to strip that slip. I don't understand what you mean. Zaram and her friend fought over a man. What is wrong with it? Why would the maidens of Osili fight one another over a stranger? Why? I don't Chuch. understand. Chuku the Nibo may not be from Osili. But he's been here for a very long time, so you can't refer to him as a stranger. That is not enough reason to fight over him. Hmm. Every sensible maiden would like to have him as a husband. So don't make me think that you're senseless. How? In Ajum, how? Are you not supposed to be among those maidens fighting for him? Hmm? Or does your poor widow of a mother not deserve somebody that is that rich and responsible as a son-in-law? Eh? Then he should chase after the woman he wants and not the other way round. Eh? Mm. Mama, imagine Zopota and Zaram, two very close friends in constant fights because of him. Hey, I'm a quick audio. Who change? They did so because they are sensible. And I hope you have a man that is better than him. Hmm? If not, you better pack your load now. I don't even know why I'm having this conversation with you. Now call me for my man. Promise to do this for me, and not without a price, of course. Or do I still owe you? Oh, Chichi, I say you're still owing me. I'm doing all I can. I'll get back to you. Just need to be patient. At least share your progress with me. What is he saying? Have you even told him about me? How can you say that? Of course I have. Just that. Chukutunibo is a man of very few words. One hardly knows what he's up to. He tells no one about his personal affairs. Madika, I came to you because I do not want to be amongst those maidens that flaunt themselves cheaply at him. I want to penetrate him in a more mature way. I don't know why you're finding it difficult. It seems you're finding this difficult. Uchechi, patience is a virtue. And those that have it are never led astray. Meaning? So relax. Eh? Soon you are going to smile. I am Madoka. I'm the game planner. Eh? I'm in charge. Relax. You know you are looking for trouble, don't you? It's me, Okudeli. When did this one start? Why have you decided to be an obstacle to me? Hmm? Okudeli, why must you show your hapless face this early morning? What have I done wrong to you? What is it? 
Hapless face. Uzoma. What is the meaning of this? When did this enmity between us start? Huh? What have I done wrong? I can see that you're totally disillusioned. Better seek for help before your disillusionment drives you crazy. Nonsense. Okay, but at least tell me who you are giving that food today. Where are you taking it to? Who's on my Something is not right. Something is definitely wrong. And I must find out. I must find out. Greetings. Please, is this Chupu Dinibo's compound? Uh, who else owns this large compound where able bodied men like us will sleep? She seems to be a stranger. Yes, almost stranger, I would say. Greetings. Greetings. Who are you looking for? Chupu Dinibo. By the gods, I I'm Chukudinibo. Mobo sent me. He says I should give you the balance of the meat from yesterday. He also told me to tell you that he requires the same quantity at sunset. Pray for me that the gods will do it again. Bring out the animals from hiding so that I can shoot and kill. I promise. I will. Who is she? Who is she? I met her at uh, Mobo's bar yesterday. She's obviously Mobo's says girl. Can we start discussing about sales girls? Odukwe, she's a sales girl, and you're a young man roasting the meat that other man has killed. And you sell them. What are you? Enough. Do you know a Enough. Sorry, boss. Yanga, who are you? Are you talking to me? This is the road that leads to Chukudinimo's house. What did you go there to do? <laughs> Can someone in this village just surprise me and be nice for once? What is wrong with everybody? Hmm. I hope it's not what I'm thinking. Greetings, Chikudinibo. Greetings. <laughs> come, come with me. I need to show you this. Whatever it is, I'm sure you can show me here. Okay.
This is specially made for you. I know you like it. I made it the native way. <laughs> Do you want to taste it? Acts like this make me wonder if one is deaf or something. Or maybe it is just that one is determined to make the other one angry. What do you mean by that? I have told you times without number. Stop bringing me food, Uzama. Not when I don't see you getting an alternative. You cannot be starving when a maiden like me is here. I have said no. Very well then. Thank you very much. May the gods of my land bless you for your kindness. We say... <laughs> Come. Eat. This is really nice. I'm getting so close. Chikuti Nimo. You are for me and for me alone. See, if only she knew that this her delicious food ends up in the belly of the three wise men, she would stop bringing it. Yeah, Yamaduka, <laughs> going to tell her is not beyond what you can do. I know you very well, but listen to me. Hmm? You better keep your tongue shut. Why are you reading I didn't say I will tell her now. I will not. Odukwe, will you tell her? It is high time someone took it upon himself to tell her that I will never eat the food that she brings. But when you see, I keep asking myself, why refuse to eat her food? Yes, when you see, tell us why you always reject her food. This food is very tasty. It's very tasty. I am a man of the gods. I never do anything on my own. I pray to continue that. Mm. What is it? Kwame. Hmm? Mm. What are you sure? Look at her. One would think she's coming from an important place. Wait. You mean Uzama? I'm sure she's coming from Chigudunugu's place. So this is true. Odukwe told me that she takes food to Chukudinibu every order. Who told her he cannot fend for himself? Desperate fool. Wait a minute. What has come over our maidens? What has come over them? Everyone wants to be with Chukudinibu. Is it because I've not asked you yet? Because I know you've joined them. No. I've not joined anybody. So what were you doing taking water to him the other day? Don't forget my man works with him. I was... I was only being nice to him. You know he has no sister and... And who told you he cannot fend for himself? You just said that about Uzoma. See Chikube. I will be here to see as the drama unfolds between Chukudinibu and Osili Nidlitz. I'll be here. What has come over her? Hmm. Why would she talk to you like that? That is not even my problem. I saw her take the food of Chukudinibu. I could not believe my eyes. Listen, listen, um, you have to calm down. That is not a reason for you to worry. Maybe she didn't mean anything, but she knew something. No way she told me to my face that I, Okudili, am happiness. 
<sighs> no, just calm down, all right? Don't tell me to calm down. Don't tell me to calm down. I cannot lose my woman to a stranger from another land. I will not. Okudele. Oh, Okudele. Oh, Don't do something stupid, though. What has come over these marriages? They are dumping their men for Chukudini. And if you're not saying you should marry all of them, as far as I'm concerned, you've not shown interest in any. Not even one. Strange. Is anything wrong with our maidens? If not that we know you very well, I would have said that you are doing the other one. I appreciate your concern, all of you. But the truth is that women are the least of my problems right now. Let me see. No man will be praised for saying that. We all need these maidens. You all know me as a successful hunter from Uru Nibu. True. But you have no idea where I'm coming from. Before my father died, he said to me, he said, Son, in everything that you do, Ensure that a woman, and never let a woman take away your senses. Be wise in matters concerning women. Yeah, I believe every father could have said that to their sons. My father said something like that to me. And your father should have said My father even told me more. Uh -huh. Mine was not just your regular cliche. My father suffered. He suffered in the hands of the woman he called his wife, my mother, before he died. She was so mean to him that people around, people around wondered if they were enemies and not husband and wife. As a matter of fact, he died as a result of her ill treatment. I'm sorry, it's so sad to hear that. The most painful part is that I was there to witness it with him. I was there with my father. And day to day, day by day, I watched as my mother sustained the gradual and systematic destruction of the man that not only married her, but cared for her. does it look like that I'm going? Where? Yeah. I'm going out. Njideka, mm. the least you would have done was to tell your husband that you are going out. <laughs> husband? And where is the husband? Njideka. Njideka. I'm still searching to see the husband. Njideka, you are going from worst to worst. So I am no longer qualified to be called your husband in Jideka. You are not qualified to be called a husband, let alone to be called Njideka's husband. I am not under any obligation for you to know where I am going to and where I am coming back from. Have I made myself clear? Papa, why does mama treat you like this? This is not how my friend's mothers behave. Why is mama so different? 
Chukodinibu. You are still a little child. When you grow older, you will understand certain things better. Papa, I'm old enough to understand anything. I see things, I'm not blind. Mama does not treat you right and it is not good. Just look at her Quaker, she has not eaten anything. I understand. I do not wish to label your mother a bad wife. Mother. But our people always say that marriage is like a sealed bundle. When you open it, whatever thing you see, you take it. My son, I never dreamt of having bad marriage. I never. I will never allow my wife to treat me like this. Never. Nobody prays for that. But as a father, I advise you to be very wise and at a lot when it comes to issues concerning women. Some come pretending to be what they are not. But when you, my son, decide to take anyone as your wife, I want you to make sure that you must have tasted her in every possible way. Understand? Yes, Papa. Papa, I'm very, very hungry. And I need something to eat. I understand, my daughter. My daughter, I will make sure you have something to eat. Is that what this foolish man told you? you are, is that what he has been telling you? You are the foolish man here, not my father. Ah, don't lay your beauty hands on, on him again. Leave him alone. Mm. So, you finally told my children against me. Am I seeing you? Nchide, did you know when you left this house and you are coming back now? Did you even bother yourself about what your children will eat? Did you? Why should a bad mother? What about the children? Can they have a good father? Why? Nchide, so you have eventually lost it. Hmm. So you are completely mad now, isn't it? You are asking me a question. You are asking me a question. By the time I finish with you today, the question, the answer will come by itself. Then what them? Is it my own you that I've seen in that group? Eh? How many times have I warned you not to touch my things? Give the food for the children. I'll give them a Drop the food for the children. Which children? The children that would have for the mommy. I said drop it for the children. I'd rather die than for me to drop this food. I'll give us our food. Give us our food I'll back. Which food? Who is your mother? Which mama? Next time if you want to cook, cook for them. You go to the market and buy your own ingredients. I'd rather die than to drop this food. This is not fair. This is not fair, mama. This is not fair. So you threw the food? I made for my children a way. Mama, this is not fair. This is not fair. Nice if you want to go. You want to buy your own children. I'm not going to Stupid people. I will kill you in this house if you don't take time. I will kill you by myself. Ha! Mama, this is not fair. You are wicked. <laughs> it was then I asked myself, 
I said to myself, I said, why involve yourself with something that will end you someday? It just does not make any sense. So sorry, Wanishi. But every woman is not the same. There are still some good ones out there. Maybe. Just maybe someday I will find that woman who is different. Who will make me love her. But till then, I have no business with her. Well, how do you find that woman when you're not ready to give one a chance? When I see her, I will know. I will. The spirit of my late father will lead me to her. You really suffered as a child. My father died as a result of my mother's treatment. Every time I see a woman, somehow, somewhere, I just see that same woman that brought me into this earth. I'm yet to find a wife. But when I do, I will surely know. Not the implication of his fear. All these maidens that are playing everything to get him will not succeed because he has no interest in any of them. And he think and he may never will. Huh? Why? They are just wasting their time on a man that has no feeling for them. Ngekete <laughs> <laughs> as as what? As this woman or what? As whatever you call it, my dear Sarah. <laughs> but Maduka told me that Chukuchu will eat no woman's food. Hey, <laughs> wonders shall never end. interested in matters that concern the great hunter of Uru Nebu to the extent of discussing him with Madoka. She put him. <laughs> what is this one talking about? Madoka is my friend. And we get to talk about Chukudinibo whenever we talk about his work. Pico, I am not interested in your Chukudinibo. Nekwa. Eh, hey, Uzoma. If you cook for Chukudinibo, who then cooks for Okudin? Okudin. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Pico. Who is Okudin? <laughs> Listen. Chukudin cannot go a day without my food. And I know that soon. <laughs> Very soon. He will do the needful. <laughs> <laughs> Dream. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Are you girls this dumb? Asked. I mean, ask me to marry him, of course. Dream. That's the needful he will do soon. <laughs> <Dream. laughs> 
wait, 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 wait
And the longer he stays, the deeper the wound. Let me help him. No, 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 no. If you want to help me, go and fetch him. Go and fetch you, Kujini, you want to help me tell him his stuff has come to a human being, no? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Maduka, Maduka, do not tell me this thing will go to. Hey, oh, Maduka. <laughs> Does it mean I will not get any supplies today? No, that is the reason I stopped over here first. I've already instructed my boys, they will supply you with that supply. But please, keep the money for me until I return. That, 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 that is not a problem at all. That, what? I hope there's no problem. Whenever your king spends some money, you never know what he's going to do. No, but at least you will get to meet your people. It is indeed high time. Go in peace. And please extend my greetings to them. Yeah, come on. The strong man of Uru Nebo. No push me today. No, he's going to supply us later this evening. That's what he did to tell you. This chukwu didn't go do any hunter in this life. Something like that. And you know, he is a hunter with touch of excellence. A man of the gods. Unlike many of the hunters in our land here that uh, will always spend the whole night in the bush and they will not see anything to bring back. The gods of this land will always lay animals out from passion for him to come them down. That's why he's the one. <laughs> My daughter, you are lucky. Just a trap. Not a poison trap. Like the one of that used to say. <laughs> but ensure you do not move around with it. I shall return in another two days. Yeah. Hmm? You see how it is. Okay, you can move for Saturday. I shall be going. Hey, am I told? Oh, hey. How did you say you didn't even get yourself into this? Hmm? I went to the bush to get forage for the goats. <laughs> you went to the bush. That place where Chukudinibo catches wild animals. When did you start getting food for the goats? It has always been my work. But I wanted to help. Have I done anything wrong? No. I wanted to stop and make the goats happy by feeding them with grasses they've not eaten before. And this is what I get. Are you okay? Sorry, huh? Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Mama, the worst is that the man that set the stupid trap has not come here to tender an apology. Hey! You are more an amazing. <laughs> that young man owes you no apology. It's the truth. <laughs> if you take this case to the elders, they will tell you the same thing. Hmm? <laughs> the same is true. <laughs> don't know them, don't know. Father? <laughs> Why are you being defensive, Maduka? I'm not being defensive. What I said is the obvious. What happened to her could have happened to any other person. But it never happened to another person. Hmm? Who goes to that part of the forest where we do not have no time? Chukudi Nibo has been attacked by wild animals. I don't care. Not to talk of uh, a major for that matter. One. <coughs> so what are you insinuating? All I'm insinuating is that we all know how desperate our maidens are to get to get Chukudi Nibo's attention. Of course, I'm not sure. You could say about uh, other maidens, but not to change it. It's different. <laughs> 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 Why are you laughing? <laughs> what I said is the obvious. She's not like the other maidens that play their way to get her to be the movie. She's different. Oh, <laughs> Katie. Different. <laughs> Why are they laughing as if they knew something? You think they are? I'm still waiting for you to tell me why you consider what you're different. <laughs> tell me. So, you know, 
So that is why I decided to come and see you myself and I. And you did well, my son. Thank you, man. And you have shown that you are a wise man. Thank you, man. Uzoma, you heard all that he said. Now tell me, what has he done to offend you? Papa, is that all you can say? What right does Papa did he have to report me to you? He has no such right. He is here betrothed. He can come to me when things go wrong. Eh? I will say nothing while he's here. Opudre? No. I shall get back to you. No. Talk to her. Please talk some sense into her. I'll get back to you. You and Okudele are as good as married. Eh? You are supposed to be getting married to him. P Papa, what if I tell you I have someone else that is better? Don't be silly, young lady. Eh? He is a betrothed. Eh? What nonsense man that got into your head? Speak before I lose it with you. <laughs> Chuku Dinibo. I'm seeing Chuku Dinibo. Eh? Chuku Dinibo? Yes, Papa. What you are doing to my daughter is sex, eh? And I'm not joking. But then, Ma. 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 I'm sorry. Ma. I love your daughter so much. I love her. Okay. I promise you, I'll go and gather money and I'll come and pay her by price. 